Okay, I saw this being sold in Shopee for very cheap and I just have to purchase it just to review it. These fancy looking earphones, perfume headphones. Yeah, I don't know what that means, but whatever. Okay, these performance parameters, I don't think they're legit, but we'll see. We'll test them out. Okay, let's just open it. Let's see how they look like. The part of me when I look at the Shopee listing. They look interesting because, you see this? It does look kind of interesting, right? Okay. The fact that it looks interesting might, might be hiding the fact that they're not very good earphones okay nothing fancy here just earphone look look at that look at that color black and gold cable Ugh. ugly if you tell me it has manual volume controls here which is quite handy has a microphone has a button to answer your calls but the question is does it sound good for eight ringgit? Eight ringgit something, I don't know. Okay. I think you already know the answer. For eight ringgit, you cannot expect quality like uh, more expensive earphones, of course. Okay, let's just open up Spotify here. Connect this up and I'll play a few songs. And I will let you know how it sounds like. I will just describe how it sounds like. I think you know how they will sound like, but here it goes. Okay, it does create a seal, which is good, I guess. So, 21 Savage, I know that this song has a lot of bass. Let's just go to the album straight away. Let's play this one. I don't hear any sound. I think I'm supposed to... Ah, okay. Does not have... It does not have much volume to it, but... Let's play the song longer. Yeah, it's quite bass heavy. I would say they don't sound as bad as I thought they would be. It does not sound so boxy. That's my favorite word, saying that something sounds boxy. It's, it's okay for this kind of songs, hip hop. Let's try something else. How about some Barry White? Let's see if Barry White sounds nice in this earphones. Okay, they sound, they sound fine for what they are, very cheap earphones, cheap in-ear earphones. I'm pleasantly surprised that they don't sound terrible because I've had other cheap in-ear earphones before, like 10, 20 ringgits that does not sound as okay as these, okay? I think the only thing about uh, this whole package is uh, they don't provide you with extra ear tips. I think this These ear tips are too small for my ears. They don't create a proper seal But once I wiggle them around in my ear and I get a proper seal. It sounds okay. I Think they sound exactly like those um, me basic uh, earphones those me basic uh, piston earphones. I think they sound similar a whole lot of bass, 
a bit um, muddy highs okay mids but don't get me wrong um, if you want a proper listening experience uh, this is not the way to go but this is a way to start all right this is not bad and the thing that I like about them is they have this volume control you can crank up the volume here and still control it here which is nice so I would not I would not really recommend this there are the options out there but if you have 8 ringgit to spare why not right it's 8 ringgit it's, it's a throwaway headphone you can just put it in your bag or something and listen it on the go without worrying about um, damaging one of these because these are dirt cheap anyways so thank you for watching uh, this video and I hope um, it has been beneficial or informational so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video bye